The Grand Prix of St. Pete was supposed to be the first race of the IndyCar season. Now it is the last. But as our Kevin Lewis found out, the drivers are just happy to be back racing at all. Originally scheduled for March 15th, but October 25th will do. The 16th annual Grand Prix of St. Petersburg pushed back due to the pandemic, but just having the race at all is a welcome sight for Sebastian Bourdais and the rest of the Bay Area. All sports, really, without the fans, we're, you know, we're missing a, a, a massive piece of, of the puzzle. It's just great to be able to just finally feel like maybe things are going to start to um, catch up a little bit with, with normalcy and, and uh, you know, can't, can't wait to see people, uh, you know, enjoying some racing, being outside and and staying safe you know, at the same time. Bourdais said this year has been upside down with regard to the actual racing, but he's happy to have something on the schedule that will include a limited number of masked fans. It was a very difficult year, obviously a lot of uncertainty and rescheduling and what's, what's it going to be. And so, yeah, a lot of questions, but I, I feel like we've been super fortunate, obviously, to still get the seasons in. Everybody's been striving to to try and get something to, to people to, to keep everybody entertained, and uh, it's worked out pretty good despite the circumstances. Bourdais told me he was in his native France and traveling during the Lightning Stanley Cup run. He said he probably stayed up a little too late to watch some of the overtime games, but it was worth it because it was a long time coming and he was excited to see the Bolts lift the Stanley Cup again. Bourdais will try to lift his own trophy right here in 18 days. In St. Petersburg, I'm Kevin Lewis, ABC Action News.